Hello everyone, it is December 28th, 2022, and we're back with our daily Nerdle. Nerdle number 2343. Okay. I hope it's not a one operation multiplication, but I will still try it anyways. I'm gonna just do this test, even though it usually is not good, because I just like it. <laughs> Okay, so we placed the two, and what do we know? There is another two, and it's uh, two operations. Times will go in one of these, and we could have a minus, and I think that's what it is. Um, so let's put a 64 minus... Um, oh, but there has to be a 1. No, then I'm going to put the 1... What if I put 16 minus 4 times? No, but this has to be a 2. Oops, okay. Could be, um, like that. 14. Oh, that actually fits as a matter of fact. Look at that. Oh, <laughs> I was just trying to put things. Oh, that actually just fits. Let's go with it. Ah, oh, wasn't the answer though. Okay. Well, got the two. We placed both of the twos. This, okay, so it's going to be a division. Which one is the division? So then based on that, if this is the division, this is a forced four. But I don't think it is because we had an equation on November 16th on the day, I'm rec on the day I am recording where it was like this. So, it could just very well be 6 divided by 12, and I think that is what it is. So, 6 divided by 12, and then times 4, uh, because we need to put the 4. And it is half times 4, and that does equal to 2. And on today's one, on actual today, November 16th, it was 7 divided by 14 times 2, which is 1. So, that was also half times 2 equals 1. Today, it's half times 4 equals 2. So there you go. Um, I do not like these equations at all. They really make my brain go to a whole bunch of places. <laughs> really makes my brain work. <laughs> if you want to see more videos, please subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.